Tag two, baby. I can't believe it came out like that. It's just here. We're just playing it. We're just involved. It's insane. It's crazy. It's nuts. We're among it. Yo, I feel that, Stilo. Yo, thanks for popping in, dude. Take it easy, brother. I appreciate that, dude. Yo, what's up, new man? Oh, yeah. Oh, that music. Is that new music? Dude, that's new music. Dude, I love you too, bro. That's new menu music. Hold up. Okay, so with your purchase of the Ancient Gods Part 2, you have received the Barbarian, aka Conan. Earn event XP, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, wow. Um, That is quite the skin. Bro, there's new fucking menu. <laughs> and that. What's up, everybody? Zippo, Boyx, AFAM, Zorex, Ollie. Dude, the new menu music? Ah! Alright, here we go. The World Spear. Previously on Ancient Gods, Part 1. The war against evil continued as the Slayer resurrected the Dark Lord himself in an act of defiance against the Makers. Leaving the heavens in ruins, the Slayer must now survive the treacherous journey to Amora, the capital city of Hell, to face the Dark Lord in ritual combat. If the Slayer is victorious, any demons outside of Hell would be destroyed and all connections to the Dark Realm would be severed. If he loses, the Dark Lord and his armies will rule all. I'm good, Antasma. I'm hype as fuck. I, did not, I have not gone to bed. Here we go, right back where we started. And yes, I put the default skin back on because Default skin is life. He he is him, you in their world. Crude, what's up, dude? Bulldog. Oh shit. Oh shit. Yeah. He said. No blood oh. can be spilled in this holy place. Our time will come. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, oh, you pussy! You're a pussy, boy! Yeah, get out of here! Get out of here! You know you don't want to fuck with me. Fuck yeah! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! I'm coming! I'm coming! I'm coming! All over you. Wait, what? Dude, I'm coming. Oh my god! It's, uh, is this The Last of Us? This shit is gorgeous. Let's go. So what is it? This is a sentinel. Is this a, like a sentinel world? That's what is that? The world spear, right? Ew, what is this? No, no, I don't fuck with it. I already don't fuck with your race car HUD. I'm sorry, Hugo. I know you probably put a lot of effort into it, but I do not fuck with it. Doom Eternal Mastery. You now have all. Yeah, 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 yeah. I've been had the tools. So, okay, hold on. Let, let, let's humor him for a bit. Let's humor him for a bit. Um. Let's turn the full HUD on. So what? Shows my chainsaw pips. And wait, what's that on the left? What's that on the left? Oh, is that my flame belch? Yeah. Okay, now how do I turn it off? Reticle ability indicator type off nice i know you guys probably like it's cool it's cool but 
That shit's turning. That shit's gone. Okay, I'm already loving the scale. Um, I'm already loving it. And then support runes will turn uh, break blast on. Well, damn, Moonwalker. The UI, it's the race car HUD. All right. All right, I bet there's some secrets back here. It is beautiful. Yeah, I don't like it, Zorex. Not a fan. I'll turn that off. Get him out of here. Okay. What? Um. Oh. Cool. What? Meet hook grapple point. Oh shit, Proto is gonna love this shit. Use the super shotgun to meet hook on grapple points to traverse the world. Yep. Cool. They're teaching people how to meet hook. I love it. Combine double jump dash and additional grapple points. Was this Skyrim? What's up, SR? Yeah, no, it does look like Skyrim, dude. Fucking dope. God, look at this. Look at this level. Looks like you go up there. I think I go up there eventually. It's beautiful. Oh yeah, dude. No, I'm glad they're they're teaching people how to meat hook, man. That's that's great. Screecher zombie. Oh shit. Okay. The screecher zombie is a fragile enemy who temporarily buffs all demons in the area arena when killed. And they they're purple. Funny purple demons. Can you chainsaw them? No. Doge! My Doge! I will save you. Wait, I probably already missed some seekers, haven't I? There's a BFG cell out over here. Oh, you're grabbing a second. Yo, Debbie, what's good? Thanos demon, Thanos demon. Yo, high level weeb. What's up? Appreciate that. Thanks for the follow, dude. Copying God of War. The new HUD, it's literally, it just tells you all the things that are already on your HUD, but near your crosshair. That's that's literally what the new HUD is. Zorax. That's literally all it is. It's called, Hugo coined it the race car HUD. Go, Doge. God, the default view models are so fucking bad. Like, why is there not just in-game view model customization? Wait, is chain gun fixed? Oh, fucking thank God.
It's music though. Oh. Oh shit! <laughs> We're literally in, like, The Last of Us right now. The Armored Baron. Whoa. The Armored Baron can only be killed after his armor has been destroyed. Use the plasma... Yeah, I'm going to bed, guys. Okay. Use the plasma rifle to slowly break and destroy his armor over time, or shoot his mace which is a weak point when it flashes green, destroy it instantly. Okay. The armor will eventually regenerate, interesting. Okay. Yeah, dude, look at this fucking place. Yo, thanks, Crude. We do be gaming. Yo, Geek, what's up, bro? Oh, yeah. Where's, like, the funny secrets? Oh, I didn't even get that BFG cell, did I? Who cares? Who needs that shit? Oh, fuck! Wait. Oh, my God, id. Yes. They know exactly what we like. Big open arenas with awesome fucking meat hook spots. Yes! This is amazing. Fuck as works. What the fuck? There's like a million fucking M's. What the fuck? <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, what's up, Shrey? It looks like it eventually becomes a jump pad, I think. Wait, what? I'm guessing you jump down there, but... Hold up. That looks like it's also supposed to be a jump pad. Bruh, what, Zorix? What the fuck? Why is your shit so busted? That's right, I, I deserve this for not playing with the HUD. I kind of go as, why is it red? Oh, I guess you can't use it. It's odd that it would even let you go to it though. I get that one up. I guess we go down here. Bet.
Dude, this music is a vibe. Am I supposed to be doing something? Like, why is there only fodder? What? Why am I grabbing that? Where's the goo? Oh my god, that's so loud. It does not know how to mix audio game audio, I swear. That's like the loudest shit of all time. That dog. It's the maker drones all over again. What the fuck? What is this? What is this? <laughs> that's fucked up. Not really though, I mean they do put the barrels there. What is this? Oh fuck. That's fine. Okay, fine. You are my little Yo, producer. crude. Yo, appreciate that sub, man. Yo, thanks so much, dude. Appreciate that, brother. Oh, that can't be fr frozen. Oh, fuck. Appreciate that, dude. Yeah, yeah, I, I actually like that arena, though. It's kind of cool. Shit. What? What's the trigger? What's the trigger? Huh? Okay. Kinda weird. Wait. Oh yeah, okay. Any secrets I missed? Doesn't look like it. There's nothing down there, right? Yeah. Yeah, he just dipped. He doesn't want none of that smoke. Dark Lord doesn't want any of that smoke. All right, we rescued Doge. This is confirmed that Doom Slayer's Doge, by the way. Wait, purple goo. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, this is a troll fight. This is a troll fight. Oh shit. Wait, how are you so tanky, mother? Yeah, this might be a look. Okay, so there that's not like regular buffed enemies. That's not a regular buffed enemy. They're tankier too. Holy shit. Okay. Um. Yeah. Good thing I didn't play UN first. Yeah, that's fucked up. That's actually fucked up. So not only are they buffed, like they do more damage, they attack faster, but they're they have more health. Wow, get good. Oh, funny.
What? Oh, the fucking headshot. That's bullshit. The headshot. That's actually fucked. Okay, that's doable. It spawns on the right side, I'll remember that. So, just don't headshot anything, that's for fucking sure. I don't think it's they're as strong as possessed. Okay. <laughs> that's fucked up. They're like, nah, you're not going through that. Oh, that's a quad? I don't need your damn quad. Protecting an energy signature from Commander Valen. Okay. I always thought it was Valen. Alright, he's here. Oh. This is this some kind of like church? It's a church, isn't it? Kind of looks like a church. Yeah, this music goes hard. Yeah, Dommy, what's up, dude? Yeah, the fucking purple goo. That's how they get you. What? He's a force ghost? My son's curse has been lifted. And I atone for my sins. Okay. Use the Sentinel Hammer to daze demons and refill your ammo. Wait, it refills your ammo? Okay, I'm on board now. I'm on board now. More ways to get ammo, the better. Hammer demons in groups to maximize resources dropped. To fill its meter, destroy weak points and glory kill demons. Yes. Yes. They're rewarding smart play. I love that. Wait. Oh yeah, okay. Boom. Glory kill the demon. Okay. Hammer the demon. Press V. I might need to rebind that. Yeah, ye Wait, I didn't even get to see it. In addition to giving ammo, the Sentinel armor can also boost the effects of your equipment. Combo the Sentinel Hammer with Ice Bomb to boost health drops. Combo the Sentinel Hammer with Flame Belch to boost armor drops. <laughs> the fucking sound effect. <laughs> fucking Reinhardt. The sound effects. Are so gamey. I don't like it though. Oh, first bug, first bug encountered, first bug encountered. Okay, I'm just floating. This is me now. What the? F oh no. Boom. That ain't to kill's fodder. Okay. What is it like on possessed enemies? Oh, fuck you. I don't have it yet. Shit. 
Oh, what? I killed him? I wanna get glory kill. Stop dying! Yeah, I don't think it's that useful on them. This arena is awesome, by the way. Is that tyrant smaller than usual, or am I just tripping? Fuck. Oh my god, the stun is so long. So the hammer recharges on if you destroy weak points, or if you... Or if you no no it's not like the crucible, it's more it's more akin to blood punch. It actually recharges uh, based on other things other than just uh, pickups. It, it's not just pickups that recharges it. Yeah yeah. I love how fast it is too. It's so fast. That it's perfect in combat. Like you're you're not fucking yourself by using it. It's actually like good. Yeah, the, crew. There's a lot of juicers out here. Let me tell you. All right, where do I go? Um. Oops. Where where do I go? I haven't missed nothing, right? No. What are these? These are the escalation things, I think, right? I haven't missed any of them, right? Stone Imp. The Simps. The Simps are here. What the fuck was that? The Stone Imp. I'm not using full auto. That no. No. There ain't no damn way. Oh what? You're joking, it's not even that good. Look at look look how many times I have to fucking use this shit to kill him. Yeah, no. What's an SSG dead swap? Okay, that's ass. God damn it. That's actually ass. I'm not using your shitty mod, though. Wait, can you chainsaw them? Oh, guess we'll never find out. Yeah, juicers are good players, yeah. Right, right, right. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, I don't know. Well, what's your guys' take on the stone imps? I'm not I don't know if I'm a really big fan, to be honest. I don't know how I feel about all that.
Speedrun tactics. This is the torch of kings. Lighting it signifies to all that a warrior seeks passage to the world spear. What? I just can make flames out of nowhere? Wait, that's Exolsha. And that's Sentinel Prime, I think. We are still a day's walk away from the World Spear. We're not that far. We got a dragon. We Skyrim now, bitches. This is going to be the most hype dragon ride of all time. Yo. Dragon. Nah, I'm not activating the subtitles. Sorry. What's up, John? Oh, that's, <laughs> this is fucking sick. He's got the Slayer's mark on his head. Not the only one who wants this mission accomplished. If you defeat the Dark Lord, any demon outside of hell would be destroyed. Dog, that's so fucking hype. Dude, fighting on the dragon? Why? For what reason does this need to make this loud, obnoxious sound effect? God damn, it's loud as shit. <laughs> Alright, now is this where the... Okay, this is where... Wait. Wait, how long is this level? Holy shit. Alright. Wait, this looks like it's gonna be a combat encounter in a second. It definitely is. Yep. You can chainsaw stone imps. Get them out. I would be actually surprised if the speedrunners actually... If anybody who speedruns this, if they actually use full auto. I would be very surprised. They roll around and shit, that's so funny. Oh, fuck you, buddy.
Crude, what are you saying, dude? What what's what's happening? I'm confused. Just because you just subbed me doesn't mean you can fucking be a dick to my mods. Like what what's happening right now? Is this a joke? Do you think you're funny? Cause it's not. It's not. Stop. Weird champ, weird champ, weird champ. I got no tolerance for stupidity and dumb shit and cringe, so you're on a thin line. Okay, there we go. Now I'll be able to find out where these things are. Oh, I have a feeling I probably already missed one. <laughs> Wait. Debbie, tell me what he said. Yo, 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 no, please. Like, fuck, why? Like, I'm the fucking... The, the streamer should be allowed to see the messages that are timed out. I kind of hate how it doesn't let me see them. Check DMs. Oh, no, I saw that. I saw that. But did he say something after when I told him to stop? It's a southern thing? Okay, yeah. Well, if he does it again, I'm just going to permaban him. So, I mean, hey, thanks for the money, I guess. Thanks for the money. I appreciate that. But you might have just wasted it because you're about to be permaban for my chat if you keep it up, buddy. Maybe you should, should read this, maybe. Um, yeah, let's read it. The World Spear sparked life across the dormant planet of Argentinur millions of years ago, arriving mysteriously from the depths of space and crashing into the planet with enough force to pierce it from pole to pole. Soon after impact, the angelic creatures who had come to be known as wraiths emerged. Okay, okay. Beings of immense power that spread across the world as their magic bled into the land and seeded life throughout. It remains a mystery if the spear freed the race from within the planet, or if they arrived on the spear itself. The power of the race gave life to the people of Argentinur, who came to worship them along with the world spear, considering it a holy relic. Power continues to flow from the spear, infusing the nearby lands with magic and mutating wildlife into powerful beasts. A live wraith has not been seen in centuries, but rumors persist that some yet remain inside the world spear itself. A car ca cavernous crater surrounds the enormous spire, preventing access inside to unworthy travelers. Hammer down looking ass. Yeah, exactly. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so Debbie, what it does, it actually has a lot of mechanics tied to it. So if you flame belch and then hammer, it gives you extra armor back if you ice bomb and hammer it gives you extra health back on top of that the hammer just ba without doing any of those things gives you ammo back on kill i believe i think it has to die for it to give you ammo i could be wrong it might just give you ammo no matter what and it stuns them for a certain amount of time and yeah like all he said there's hammer pickups but it also recharges when you get when you break a weak point or blood or uh glory kill so it's kind of like blood punch and crucible mixed together like the way that you can get it back yeah it's kind of, it's kind of complicated but i'm a fan i think it's nice i like it actually i'd be interested to see uh let's turn the hud on real quick let's see how many charges do you get for it where is it? V. Oh, it's only one charge. 
right? So one use, and then you have to regain it. Okay. So you can't, you you don't get to hold multiple charges. You you can only have one at a time. Yeah, yeah, it does. It kills fodder. It does kill fodder. <laughs> I like how these arenas are just like, they're like, yeah, this this will be fun killing these demons like this. We'll put, we'll put you in a room with a bunch of barrels. Go at it. I like it. And they give you blood punch, infinite like blood punches. That's cool. Hey, what the? Okay. Interesting. Yeah, they do like the barrels. They've already done that a few times, haven't they? Um. Oh, wait. Okay, yeah. Is is this a ballista boost? Do you need to use ballista boost to do this? Okay, no, never mind. All right, here's one of the first escalation thingies. Wait, but do I have to do it? Obviously, I'm gonna do it, but. God, that's scary. That's too loud. That's too loud, id. It's too loud. All right. No, I. I guess you have to do it. Okay, I mean, I'll do it. Obviously, I'm gonna do it, but. Blood punch fixed? Yeah, actually. Holy shit. Uh, yeah, I haven't had a single failed blood punch. Oh, funny uh, arm. Look at that, funny arm. Escalation encounters are encounters with two waves of increasing difficulty. Only the second wave is optional. Beating the first wave gives a sentinel hammer upgrade. Beating the second wave gives a cosmetic. Yeah, it's it, it's it's like cosmetics that you get from the secret encounters in tag one, but now it's it's in these instead, I believe. Oops. Oops. See, and look at the range on it too. Like I, I hit that sentinel hammer like over there, but it stunned the fucking hell knight all the way over here. Blood punch actually works now. Holy shit, it works every time. All right, wave two, yeah? Oh, not again, id, not again. I thought you guys learned that this shit sucks. Sentinel hammer upgraded. Demons hit by the sentinel hammer slam will now drop more ammo. Nice. Nice. 
Warning. Interacting with the second Gornest triggers an even more difficult encounter that is for high-skilled slayers only. The encounter is optional, but beating it awards a cosmetic. If you fail, you can try it again. Give me that shit. Pain, no elemental. Oh my god, that ammo. That is so good. Yay! Oh my god, they... No, 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 they, they went crazy with this DLC. I see the promise in this. I see this promise in this, dude. The combat feels so good with the hammer. Stone imps were a little crazy, but besides that, I can fuck with it. Fuck out my game! I just want to use the hammer, dude. Using the hammer is so fun. I just keep wanting to get it back. Boom. Give me that skin, baby. Does the hammer use the ammo or is it on cooldown like the equipment? So it, it's charged up by using, by either destroying weak points or by glory kills. So it's like blood punch, but better pretty much. Like, like getting it back is better because there's more ways to get it back. Yo, Void, what's up, man? Oh yeah, Oblivion, DLC 2 is pretty lit. I wonder if future upgrades for the hammer are going to be more charges for it. Oh, I hope so, because right now we only have one charge. Honestly, I, I'm, I'm, a, I'll bet, I'll bet on that one. By the way, this skin, that skin's clean. That's my favorite color. I probably still won't use it, but that color right there is my favorite color. That light blue, I love that color. It's so nice. Fuck yeah. And worthy, nice. So far, we've only died once, and it was on that super scuffed purple goo part, so 
I'm feeling pretty... Then again, there's still two more levels, so uh, let's not get ahead of ourselves. Sentinel Hammer. Use the Sentinel Hammer on the Marauder and Armored Baron to extend their vulnerability windows. <laughs> Get out. <laughs> Fuck yes. Fuck yes. Fuck yes. Fuck yes. 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 Also, it destroys the shields on Doom Hunters and... I mean, yeah. Nice. Okay. Fuck, I don't have ammo. What? Wait, that turret just let me kill it, like, easy. Oh. Okay. Come on, buddy. Come on. Wait, I think I have it. I should have it. Sick. Yo, Raven, what's up, dude? Yeah, the blue with that blue with the red visor is clean. Oh no, anything but this, anything but this, anything but this. Yeah, fuck you, buddy. I knew that shit would work on you. I had a feeling it would work on the Bloodmaker. Yeah, dude, no, this, they they went crazy on this DLC. This game, this looks gorgeous. Uh, and I'm playing on the lowest of the low settings at 720p. Still looks great. What, touching the tentacle hurts you? Oh shit. You and run ender, you and run ender, you and run ender. They were right. Watch Mojo was right, guys. Am I the only one who thinks it's funny how it looks like the armor baron is running away when his armor is gone? I'll have to look at that next time. Yo. He is worthy. Goddamn right I'm worthy. <laughs> yeah, now we know I'm going for a dive. Man. The scale of this shit is so cool.
some kind of portal inside of the world spear. All good, JD. Hard bet, Mike. Have fun, dude. This is unlike anything we've ever encountered. Not even Erdak gave off readings like this. Yeah, because Erdak was a sham, right? Like, this is the real deal. Oh. I totally shot it. I totally shot it. That's some baloney. Not the goo. Not the goo. Yeah, the music is just fire. Seraphims? It's a ship. It's a ship. Oh, this is a ship that I'm in. The crystal and the gatekeepers. Okay, okay, let's read this. Let's take a dive. Oh. Cool. Alright. In times of de desperate need, sentinel sh shamans would approach the world spear and bear their souls to be judged. The gatekeepers, silent guardian spirits, have stood watch over the entrance to the spear since it first arrived. The shamans deemed unworthy are swiftly cut down with divine strength. Those judged as worthy would return to their tribes bearing a shard of the spear itself, a piece of the ancient spire brimming with power. These crystals can be used to power advanced technology, providing a limitless energy source. It was said that the father himself used these shards to power the gate of Divum. Or, yeah, Divum? Divum? Yo, Austin, what's up, man? We're playing the new DLC, dude. I don't know. This, is, this looks sick, though. Like, wait. Hmm, what is this supposed to be? Is this like Wraith's, Wraith power or something? I don't know. Alright, I guess we gotta grab this. Make sure there's not anything on these. Nope. I have the location. The gate of Davoom locked in. Davoom. Hold on. Okay. So I I missed one of the uh, I missed one of the encounters. Apparently, I must have missed one of them. That's wait. No, I didn't. Oh, okay, okay. So I guess it. I guess the two waves counts as the that. 
So there's only one, like, gore nest, but there's two encounters. Okay, okay, never mind. I didn't miss it. All right, bet. All right. Yeah, it is kind of weird. It's a little weird. Dolan, uh, Dolan, I'm loving it, dude. And here we go. Okay, no, this is The Last of Us. We're literally going to The Last of Us right now. I'm loving it, dude. It's lit. Hell yeah, Austin. It's good to hear, man. Same here. Hell's invasion of Earth has failed, and the Ark has led human resistance in the fight to reclaim the planet. The Slayer must locate the Gate of Devoom, an ancient artifact of the Father's design. Within the ruins of an overgrown city, once activated, the path to Imora will be opened. Yeah, no, this is dope. This map is going to be dope. Oh, mm, mm. I already love it. I already love it. This might already be my favorite level. Oh, God. Yeah, no, this, this is sick. This is sick. You have the key to the gate of Devoom. I will mark its location. Good looks in turn. The only way into the most ancient part of hell. The Dark Lord will be there waiting for you. Cryo. Marauder. <laughs> Cabernet Sauvignon. I'm not even going to try to say that word. Marauder. The Marauder. Savior of mankind. The people of Earth have come to view the Doomslayer as a savior, a hero who fought to free their world from the clutches of hell itself. The legend of the Slayer has been spread among survivors of the war, broadcast on emergency radio frequencies, and used as a symbol of resistance against the demons. Prophets proclaim to all that the Slayer has brought his war to hell itself. The people of Earth offer their prayers for his victory as they spread his sigil and raise his banner inspired to fight back by his deeds. Yo, Calpria, what's up? What's up, what's up? It is here. And we are playing it. It's kind of crazy. Look at the flock of birds. Look at that flock of birds. Mm, it's so good. Those mechs though. Who the fuck? Cursed? You are cursed? If you are hit by the cursed prowler, you will become Hey Kyle cursed. You will become Hey Kyle cursed. You will take damage over time and be unable to dash or target the cursed prowler with lock on weapons. When cursed, blood punch the cursed prowler to kill it and remove the effect. Okay, I kind of have to test this. I kind of got. Okay, hit me. Curse me. Okay. So, I can't kill him. He's invincible. He's literally invincible. Oh, but I can't dash. Fuck. Wait, I'm fucked. That is the most scuffed enemy in the game. I don't like that one. I'm not a huge fan of that guy. What I am a huge fan of is this open ass arena. It's sick. Yeet. <laughs> that bottle of Marauder looking tasty. Look at all those cars. So many. So the game wants me. Ooh, I see you. 
That's probably where I have to go, though. Okay, uh, there you are. I knew it. I knew it. I knew you'd be. I knew there'd be something there. Hammer the Prowler? Uh, I could try that. I could try that. Slayer sighting confirmed. Please save and exit your workspaces. Why would there ever be a fucking emergency broadcast for some random ass office building about the Doomslayer? That cursed prowler is gonna make many people rage, I can already tell. It's gonna make me rage. Okay, I'm gonna let it. Hold on, I'm gonna kill the pain first. Okay, hit me, hit me. Okay. Oh, you motherfucker. You motherfucker. Fuck that guy. You. Fuck that guy. Fuck everything about him. Why would it do that? Like, you can only damage him with the blood punch? What happens if you don't have blood punch? You're fucking dead. You're actually dead. Come here, boy. Oh shit. Bro, like in arenas with the cursed prowlers, you're gonna wanna have that shit. You're gonna wanna have a blood punch or you're gonna die. You're actually gonna die. Shit. This mank's gotta go. Yeah, if people complain about the Marauder, they're gonna be complaining a lot more about that Cursed Prowler. Like, the Stone Imps are a little annoying, but that Cursed Prowler, oh, they, they, they gave them the correct name. That, let me tell you, that shit is actually cursed. Oh, fuck. Oh god, they're like the fucking skeletons from Dark Souls. The wagon skeletons. Uh -uh. Okay. Oh, it's a big meat hook. Big meat hook. Yeah, you'll need to find a way to activate the power in this part of the city. Let's see what we got. Escalation counter. All right, bet. Uh, a hammer pickup near me. Okay. Hey. 
How, though? I guess I gotta open that somehow. There we go. Power restored. You should be able to continue towards the gate now. What? Riot Soldier. AKA Chain Gunner. The Riot Soldier's indestructible shield absorbs all frontal damage. Shoot behind their shield to destroy them. Perfect for me. I use remote debt. So there we go. And they like instantly die. Yeah, yeah, that changes nothing. So I'm fine with that actually. Those guys are easy, easy work. Wait. Oh, it has a cooldown. So you you can you can use the meat hook multiple times, but it has a cooldown. So there's no cooldown for your meat hook, but there's a cooldown for those. But like actual latch points. Okay. Cool. See other worlds and get paid for it. Yeah, exactly. Like nobody's using plasma anyway. Except for spirits. All right, escalation counter time. What the? That was weird. All right, let's get it. With sword and might. Poker. The Cursed Prowler. I hate that guy. He's priority number fucking one. Like, he might have just made up... He, he might have just ended up on my number one list over the Bloodmaker. I can't believe it, but here we are. Okay, you actually have to, like, stun him first. Fair. There. Well, the dog is a lot louder now, of course. Wonder, did they fix falters? Let's see. Mi Wait, did they? No fucking way. Hold up. Let's test it again. I think they might have. I think they might actually have fixed falters. Sick. What? Bruh. I think so. I think they might have actually fucking finally fixed it. Nice. Now, what's this upgrade? Fire and ice boost. Okay, so just, it, I'm not even gonna look at the description. I'm gonna guess it boosts the flame belch and ice bomb capabilities. Demons hit by the Sentinel Hammer Slam while on fire will drop more armor and if frozen will drop more health. Yep.
Oh, you fucker. Oh. There's definitely gonna be a cursed imp, and I'm gonna get screwed for doing this. Because I don't got no blood punch now. Yeah, that's the first Marauder, yeah. Like, I'm almost scared to use my blood punches on anything because you never know there's gonna be a cursed Mar uh, or a cursed uh, Prowler. Nice. There you are. Yeah, get him out. You're gonna have to get possessed. Oh my god, possessed cacos are crazy. What? You fucking bitch. Oh, fuck. Hello. Yeah, the, the Marauder's dog is loud. I don't know why they have to do shit like that, but now we have to live with that for fucking months now. So that's going to be fun. Or maybe forever. The Marauder dog might sound like that forever. And we'll just have to live with it. Uh, After further inspection, not a fan. I don't like that the visor's green. Why, why would you get the whole black and red theme, but make the visor green? Uh, not a fan. Not a fan. I already have full BFG. What the fuck? Right, you can't you can't do that. That's that's fucking sacrilege. So this is just a playground. Alright, 
the gates of Devoon. Built eons ago by the father, first deity of the makers, the gate of Devoon was used to access the hidden city of Amora deep in the heart of hell. The father used the gate to travel into hell and oversee Amora, keeping personal watch over the dark city. The portal has been inactive since the Dark Lord was cast down by the Father himself. Now dormant, it requires a tremendous energy source to reactivate. When the Father willingly gave up his throne in Erdak, and with the aid of his loyal servant, Samur Maker, he was deconstructed into the AI known as Vega. In this form, he obscured, obscured himself from the vision of the Dark Lord and maintained close watch over his creations on Earth. The Gate of Devoom remains unused and hidden from all who would seek to access the Dark Lord's realm. That's interesting. I like that we find out why the fuck that happened in the first place. Pretty dope. These encounters are not that bad. Yeah, no, I fuck with it. I definitely fuck with it. Curse Prowler, though. Eat my entire ass. Wait. Yeah. Oh, I thought there were, I thought there was like a codec page like talking about them. Yeah, cur curse prowlers are curse. That's fine. Oh, that's where I came from. Water. Oh no. I'm scared. Bro, this map is awesome. I'm really liking it. I'm just reading all the little tiny things. Deliver us from evil. Super duper sale, end of season. Don't miss out on crazy deals. The Chairman's Club, only the best. I wonder who a Robert Altman is. It's probably somebody that works at it. Wait, are you about to tell me this is an arena? <laughs> Stratton, nice. Marty Stratton. Settle down, ruddy. Simps. Yeah, this map is crazy. Speaking of Samurai, I wonder if we will see him again in this DLC. Maybe. I have a feeling we will. I have a feeling we will. Likely. More lore, oh my goodness. The betrayal of the father. Our research, oh my god, these are getting longer and longer. Our research shows that maker history and lore holds truths that are not consistent with passages found in the hell priest's texts, revealing the true origins of hell in all surrounding dimensions. 
This revelation would explain why hell is the single dimension that connects to all others, and why it is the oldest in existence, the first world. In the beginning, the world of Jakkad, later known as hell, prospered under the guidance of their leader, leader Devath. Davith, or how the fuck you say his name. He longed to solve the riddle of, his, of immortality for his people, an ability only he possessed. His efforts met with failure, as mortal flesh could not sustain the undying spirit. Using his unrivaled power, he crafted the Maker Race to find the solution, their machine, minds, working in unison. Davoth was obsessed in his effort to eliminate death from the world of Jakkad. When the Makers discovered the secret of immortality, they deemed the knowledge too dangerous to share, for in their judgment, Davoth had come to be seen as an eventual threat to all life. The Makers acted in secret and worked quickly to seal Jakkad away, and Davoth with it. While the records of Ardak were rewritten to hide the truth, enraged of Davoth became the Dark Lord, as vengeance and hatred consumed him and his world, transforming it into hell. They died to a single chain gun shield bash? <laughs> Alright, I'll keep that in mind, Zorex. Good looks, dude. Come on. I wanna look. Oh, man. Alright. Let's get it. Attention. Power activated for city subsection. We flying. Your sword is our strength. Whee! Bruh. <laughs> Bruh. Zorax. That's fucking amazing. Holy shit. That's fucking amazing. Fuck you, simp. Oh, fuck. What? Oh, floating Baron. Oh, shit. Uh, I'll try that, Zorix. I'll try it next time I see one. I'm gonna probably say probably not. I'm gonna say probably not. Unless, unless maybe you go behind them. But the fact that Sims can, that's fucking funny. <laughs> that's a good tip, Zorix. That's a good fucking tip. Now we know that the Slayer Shield is superior to the Marauders? Yeah. I mean, it always has been. Shit's OP. Ow, my feet. You fucks. Okay, here we go. Okay, it stuns them. It stuns them and knocks them back. So it opens them up to an attack. See, I was ahead of the curve. Remote Dead is so good against the Chain Gunners. Secret. Your presence gives us hope. Oh no. Oh no. Anything but this.
No! That's fine. Oh, the cat! <laughs> the cat go busting down the fucking wall. That's so fucking good. Holy shit. I love that. Kako comes busted through. Your sword is our strength. I bet that means something. Any math whizzes? Aww. Little cat. So yeah, yeah. Chain gunners is remote net the fuck out of them. Always. Ooh, this is a 2016 looking arena. This looks just like 2016. There's a lot of Hell Knights in this DLC, I've noticed. Dude, Doom Hunters are sh nothing to the hammer. Where is this fucker? No, you don't. Wait, what ha- Like, man, this- Those guys are- I, I don't know how I like- How, um, I feel about their design. You can only kill them with a blood punch. Oops. Oh shit. Wait, there's an Archie? Oh, fuck. Bonk. Yo, fall back. What's up, you juggernaut? Oh, dude, this DLC is sick. I just only made a few marauders. Oh, you don't have the year one pass fallback? Wait. I'm supposed to go there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, you don't. And the page isn't up yet, so if you... Wait, so you're telling me...
You're telling me if you don't have the year one pass, you can't buy it? Bruh moment. That's a bro moment. Yeah, that's so dumb. The store page isn't up, so you can't buy it. Okay. The gate of Divon. The only way into the most ancient part of hell. The Dark Lord is there, waiting for you. He will not allow the city to be overtaken. Like you, he will fight to the end. Wait, that's the end of this level? This level's over? It's dragging me in. That's fucking cool. I, I have no say in this. It's just pulling me in. Damn. That was the level? Okay. Bullshit. Let's get it. Imagine Proto updating the new game plus mob by adding tag two demons to the base game. I don't know if you can. I, I actually don't think he can. Like, I don't think that's possible. Then again, got spirits working. But only spirits, right? It was only spirits he got working, correct? It, blood makers are not in it, right? None of the tag one demons are. The final battle has... Does anyone notice a weird lack of music? It's a little weird. The final battle has begun. Using the gate of Devoom to access the heart of hell... The Slayer now stands before the gates of Emora, ready to face the Dark Lord. Armies now gather as the Dark Realm prepares for war, and the coming conflict will decide the fate of all. Yeah, only spirits. Oh no, that dude's a magician. Whole squad. Oh yeah, you think you're tough in your little, your little power armor? You look like a nerd. He actually looks like a nerd in that. Yeah. Dude, your breath stink. They got their own dragons? Oh, look at his little, like, under undersuit. Oh, Avengers. Where's Captain America? Oh, there he is. No, that's Thor. That's Thor. This is fucking hype! <laughs> squad! 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 This is the most badass shit of all fucking time, not gonna lie. This is fucking hype. It all led up to this. Alright, let's go. We're ballista boosting. You guys don't got this. Are you hey, well, Come on. Oh, come on. It just ruined the whole vibe. You ruined the whole vibe. Like, it's ruined. It's ruined. It's ruined. It's ruined. It's ruined. Fucking god damn it. Ruined! Any demon outside his realm 
will be destroyed. Look at them go, though. We got the whole squad. Like, they're going, dude. Oh, shit. <laughs> Bruh. God damn. We've seen all of we've seen that happen so many times, but it's always been like the after effect. Like the a after it happened, but now we get to see it in live action. He said, You're done. You're done. Sit down. No. Oh, I gotta help my boys, dude. I gotta help my boys. I gotta help my boys. Yeah, yeah. They said, oh shit, we gotta fight the Doom Slayer too? Fuck. I'm going home. All right, got. Wait, what did I just miss? God damn it, I missed something because uh, so I think like one of the um, ships like just crashed. Uh, yeah, time to read. Time to read. The Dark Lord guided the hand of the Con Maker as she directed the creation of the Divinity Machine. Oh, okay. So the Dark Lord created is is the reason the Divinity Machine exists. The Father had saved an element of the Dark Lord before he betrayed him and went into hiding. For he was reluctant, re reluctant to destroy all parts of his creator. This piece of the Dark Lord remained sealed within the coffins of Erdak. Knowing this, the Dark Lord guided the Con Maker to it, and she took its discovery as a sign from a higher power. She descended from the mountains of Ankermon with the shard needed to power the Divinity Machine they had created to save all worlds. Fuck you. This is fucking awesome, Antasma. Let's -a go. What is that? Oh, it's just hazard. Like, what the fuck? Missing something? 
Oh, funny imp. I know that's DLC update, but were there any changes made, like bug fixes and stuff? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They fit. They. I have not had a single failed blood punch this entire. Like, it. I, I think it's fixed. Blood punch is fixed. No target is fixed. Like, that shit's fixed. And also, I believe Marauders actually get faltered on slopes now. Like, I tested it. They get faltered. Demons hit by the Sentinel Hammer Slam will be days for a longer duration. But shit, it's already long as fuck, so okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You already told me a million times. Oh my god. Uh, okay. I gotta use plasma. Like, I actually have to use plasma on that fucker. Oh, fuck. Ow. That's a Marauder. Bruh, the fucking f ice bomb fucks you. Wait, do, do Maker Drones not count as weak points? Do their heads not count as weak points? Guess not. Dude, that's so fucking good. Oh my god. Marauders are actually weak shit now when you have that. Like, straight up, Marauders are weak-bodied. <laughs> Yo, appreciate that, Kyle. Take it easy, man. What difficulty are you running this on? Uh, and I don't play on anything other than Nightmare. So I am playing on Nightmare. Honestly, I probably, like... <laughs> I, I've only died once, and it was in one section that's pretty scuffed. And, like, that's it. It was, it was in one section in the beginning of the first level where there's purple goo. Yeah, no, this skin is dope. I'm, I'm, I fucks with it. I fucks with it. And Gate Smasher. The first time I saw Armored Baron, I mistook him for a full armored Hell Knight. Oh, nah, he's, he's got that Baron look. Funny Baron. What if you could kill him? Uh, it's funny that even during this entire fight, they still infight. 
The demons are still fighting each other. What? Oh. See, I heard my hammer come back because I killed the weak points on the, uh, on these Mancubus. That's fucking awesome. That looks like a secret. I wonder, can you even get to that seeker without ballista boosting? Dude, you have to ballista boost to get to that. Like, actually, th this, you have to ballista boost. Or meat hook. No, that's, that's kind of crazy. Like, you have to ballista boost or meat hook to get to it. Yo, Orkin, what's up, man? What's up? Uh, probably not, Trey. I would, honestly, I, it would be cool if they could at least let us do it in their new master levels that they eventually release. Please. Let me up. I love that you can still chainsaw them. That is nice. Whoa. Oh, the dragon. That's so fucking cool. Oh, shit. It seems the turrets. I like that. The turrets don't seem to um, to hide anymore. They just let you shoot them twice. Wait. Oh, am I about to ride on this? I have a feeling I am. Yo, the dragons, they're fighting the titan. No! Oh, he's good. He's good. Hey, yo, what's good? Uh, yeah, let me take these controls, buddy. Wait, what? Oh, there we go. I'm doing good, Orkin. Gaming, dude. We're gaming. Yep. Send me in. <laughs> I knew it. I knew it was going to send me in. We're not shooting shit down. We're, we're, we're just going to send me in. It must have been centralized here, like some kind of ruling elite. Yeah, this is the new DLC, dude. It's the rune scarred ballista, Raven. It's from the first series. Series one event. Who the fuck are you guys? They drop ammo? What the fuck? <laughs> okay, <laughs> I like those guys.
Oh, what the? What? Oh, it's pulling me in. Oh! Uh! All right, Orkin. Take it easy, man. He's right behind me. I like how it slows down time a little bit. That's kind of neat. Oh no! Oh, I did not want to do that, but I did it. Fuck. Imagine if you do that with both of the Marauders. Game ending shit right there. Yeah, no, this DLC is, re they're really flexing their fucking gameplay. All the new mechanics and shit in this DLC. It's dope. Boom, 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 boom. You guys are shit. Whoa. Wait, do those guys die when I meat hook them? They do. They do. They die to the meat hook. <laughs> That's kind of funny. I just blow up. Hmm. Secret? Looking over there, your frame rate dips a little bit. <laughs> Oh, they don't give you... Oh, no, they give you plasma. Wonder, does ballista work on them too? I mean, it only said plasma, but I mean, doesn't ballista do the same damage technically as the plasma kind of? What's this? Does this just lead to the same area? Yeah, I think it does. Do they give you ammo of every type?
I miss a Kodak? Oh, you're right. We'll go back and grab it. Very cool. You can just jump across there. I like that a lot. Oh, nice. How did I miss that? Samur was blinded with newfound conviction as, unbeknownst to him, the voice of the Dark Lord controlled and compelled him to free a stranger from his prison and bring him to the Divinity Machine. Samuel knew without knowing that if the machine could destroy a life, it could also empower it with a blinding ability. The one who would emerge from the machine would stop the reckless con maker from leading his people to ruin. Convinced he was doing what must be done, Samra reversed the polarity of the machine and gave rise to the super being who would stop the con maker and save them all. The Rise. Slayer. Ah. Can I do this? Please tell me I can! Fuck yeah! Oh, I saw you. I saw you. Don't think I didn't. I swear you had me. Oh. Dude, this fucking music, man. Critical literature. What is that for getting all of them? Nice! I, I got all of them. Fuck yeah. We take those. The final battle. It came to be as ordained by Samr's vision. The Slayer became the unstoppable force of rage against all evil. But eventually, he would turn on his masters and destroy the deceitful Khan once her alliance with the demons had been exposed to him. A corrupted Erdak lay in ruin. And Samur would soon be judged by the very savior he had created, just as Davoth had foreseen. The Dark Lord had forged the bearer of his vengeance through those that had betrayed him. It was the ultimate revenge. His monster would now come for him, and he would have to destroy that which gave him his retribution against the makers. Davoth would not run. <laughs> cap, cap, he definitely ran. For he knew the beast would find him. They would do battle on sacred platforms where the Dark Lord's minions would lie in wait to observe the outcome. Wait, is it really entry 666? Haha, <laughs> nice. <laughs> That's great. Thanks for pointing that out, Raven. That's funny. That's a cool, that's a cool photo. That's cool. Ooh, Slayer looking over the comm maker. That's dope. If I understand this correctly, Davoth created his own killer, to put it bluntly. Yep, that's about right. And also, yeah, straight remote dead is fire. Even even without the chain gunners, remote dead is just so good. You should be using it anyway. There he is. He would not run, they say. Oh, wait. He's running! He's running! He's a whole bitch! He's a whole bitch! Just like Tag 1, it seems the music is... Like... Hmm. Maybe we turn the sound effects down a little bit more. Because the music volume is like fucking, it's like so low. I, I want the music just blasting in my ears, but it's like, you can barely fucking hear it. <laughs> Facts. Yo, what's up, my Nia? Or me, Nia? Hope I said that right. Come on, come on, come on. Do your bullshit.
Oh, fuck. I'm not gonna make that mistake again. <laughs> Blood punching a, a fucking possessed Baron and being that close to him is not the move. Dude, this fucking carcass. I'm coming for your ass. Where the fuck is he? There you are. You're done. Dude, this music is fire. The Slayer is so fucking powerful, he used the meat hook to pull the ship up into the sky. Look at the pain. Look at the funny pain, Elemental. He's gonna meat hook it. He's gonna meat hook it. Fuck yeah! <laughs> oh my god! Holy shit, that's so fucking badass! That's so fucking badass! Holy shit, holy shit, holy shit, holy shit. That's so fucking badass. Boss incoming. Oh yeah. This is this is looking like boss time. Yeah, the ammo. Wait. Is that a haze pickup? It is. Oh. The Sims. The most powerful thing in the game against them. Full auto room! Full auto room! Full auto room! The full auto room! Oh my god, Mayo's gonna literally comb his pants when he gets to this part! Holy shit! Full auto! Oh my god, he's gonna comb! Holy shit, somebody send that to Mayo if you could. Yeah, someone clip that, send it to Mayo, please. I'll send it to Mayo. Oh my god. You're approaching the Dark Lord Sanctum. I'm starting to lose my connection. Not gonna lie, that's kind of fun. Not gonna lie. That was kind of fun. That was actually kind of fun. Not even gonna lie. Alright. Wait, chill, cuz I want my uh, armor. <laughs> Thanks, Debbie. Gaming. Gaming. Funzarashi. Funzarashi? Appreciate that follow, dude. Welcome. Love how the Slayer shot his meat hook in the paint on those eye. Dude, that was so fucking badass. All right, so there's four levels in this DLC. Final level. This is just for the Dark Lord fight. Let's get it. Oh my god. I actually... Hold on. I want to watch that clip right now. I'm gonna... I'm about to send it to... Pants when 
hits when he gets to this part. Holy shit. Bolada. I'm downloading the clip. I'm uploading it to Twitter. My fucking, my mic started peaking. Oh my God. Wait, is my phone going off? Hold on, my phone is going off. Auto room. What the fuck is happening? What should, it, what should it be? Um. Uh, it all, it all came to this. It all came to this. <laughs> What's up, Zambit? Oh my god, that's so fucking good. That's so fucking good. That's so fucking good. Holy shit. That's going in the clip like that. That's going in the clips channel. I'm putting it in Mayo's server. Obviously, I'll put it in the spoilers. All right, let's get back to gaming. That was uh, I, I had I had to fucking show everybody that that's so fucking good. I love that. The DLC is going great, Zambit. I actually haven't died a single time except at the very beginning of the first level when, when in that room that like fills up with purple goo. I accidentally um, headshot something and it blew up the um, the screecher and then I got fucked by the mancubus because I didn't realize that the it's a different buff than just regular buffed enemies. You just beat UN. Yeah, no, no, yeah, I'll, I'm gonna do UN right after this. Wait, did you do it first playthrough? Did you do it first run? Okay, wait, well, chill out, chill out. Don't, don't butt me and say some shit about, like, the final boss or something. Final boss is so good. All right, here we go. Oh. the dark realm, but conflict was born in hell. It is inevitable. A fire that fuels creation and gives purpose where there is none. You're easy. Counter the Dark Lord when his eyes flash green to daze him. Use a Sentinel Hammer to extend the daze effect. While in sword range, move in close, but not too close, to increase the frequency of sword attacks and green eye flashes. Okay. Um, summon wolves will drop Sentinel Hammer armor when killed. Oh, he spawns. So he's just a big marauder. Motherfucker. Bitch. Oh, 
motherfucker. Oh. Bruh. Attack me, pussy. Shit. Music goes hard. By the way, make sure you don't BP the boss when you go for glory kills. Okay. Well, I mean, I don't know if it's glory kill or if I can glory kill or not. Anyway, I have no fucking HUD or no glory kill highlights. So that doesn't help me really at all. Oh, I don't have one. Spawn your dog. Let me kill your fucking dog so I can get my shit. Why couldn't I fucking- I just picked one up! What the hell? Yeah, I mean, am I doing something wrong? Like, what's going on? What what is happening when that? What what is that? Is he healing? Is he healing when I do that? What the fuck? Shit. You have to get in close, but not too close. You need to get a feel for it. I wish I kind of knew what his HP was, but I'm an idiot, so.
You're done. What? Okay, we're in hell on earth. Say less. Fuck yeah. The Sentinel Hammer kills all summoned demons instantly. Summoned wolves will drop hammer armor when killed. Glory killing zombies will also charge hammer. Okay, yeah. What the fuck? Fuck you. Ah! Ah, you fuck. What the fuck? It's like, how do I even dodge that? He heals when I attack him when it, that happens. Uh, I, that, that, that has to be it. Oh, fuck. He's mad. I done pissed them off. Yeah, 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 it is kind of like the gladiator. I have a feel for this though. Oh shit, maybe not. Fucking music goes hard. Bop. Get out of your suit. Get out of your suit, buddy. Get out of your suit. I want to fight you man to man right now. Let's go. Get out of your shit. You're done.
He is the first being, and my creator. When he fell, I ascended. They lied to you, Slayer. Amora and its people would have been perfect, if not for the treachery of my servants. They sealed me away, stole my power and name. And now, the time has come for a This is so fucking sick. <laughs> Oh shit, we're in fucking what's its play what what the fuck is it called? Uh oh shit. The fucking place thing. Fuck, I forget what it's called. It's it's in tag one. Oh fuck. There is projections. It's wild. Shit. Nah, none of the blood swamps. The well, it's in the blood swamps, but nah, this is like a different thing. Oh, fuck you. Can't flame Belchum. Ingmore Sanctum, that's what it's called. Ingmore Sanctum. Oh, fuck.
Oh, you pussy. Keep remote deading. The music just goes in the whole fucking time. <laughs> yet. He's not summoning them yet. So spooky. Yeah, I saw it, Raven. It's so fucking cool. I actually like it. And the UN skin this time isn't actually just like an all gold skin. I wonder how much health he gets back from that. Come on, get out your suit, buddy. Yeah, you're all beat up and bloody. Get out your suit. You're weak. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, nah. He taking off the mask. Mask off. Fuck it, mask off. Oh, nah. Down. 
I ain't got shit to say. I ain't got. <laughs> oh, man, just fattest nut in the world. Oh, no. Nah. Yeah, rip, rip, he's dead. <laughs> the ones in the in the Sentinel Prime jail. That's funny. Well, fuck me. I could have done this UN first try. Well, eh, nah, it wouldn't have been first try. Wait. Wait, no, 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 no. What? I'm getting sealed away again, huh? Hmm. Yo, what's up, SD? Okay. Sealed away at the Ingmore Sanctum. But well, clearly shit is still not right, because, uh, like, they, those dudes are still in existence. They're like s seraphims or whatever. May the blood on your sword never dry. And may we never need you again. Okay. That's all she wrote. Dedicated to the memory of Robert A. Altman. He, he, he was the guy on the on the poster. Um, in the second level, I be I believe. He was the guy on, in the um. Yeah, that's cool. I was like, I was like, I bet that's a dev. Ah, he's uh, somebody that passed, and they paid respects to him. That's really cool. What do we do? Is there is there a Zambit? You there? Is there an after credit scene? Like, should I skip this or what? Oh, that's the that's the CEO of Bethesda that passed. That's true. But bro, you can watch the VOD even though the stream isn't over. world doesn't revolve around you either. Is there half of credits? I wonder. I'll just wait. The music is a vibe. Yeah, dude, I just beat it. Honestly, I could have done UN. I should have just, I should have just done UN. God damn it. <laughs> I would have beat it first try. Besides the like, like, okay, I keep saying first try. I died in the goo part, but I could have just restarted right then. And then I would have fucking beat it. I, I, I beat it without dying, essentially. I only got fucked in one, one part and it was some scuffed ass part with purple goo. Yeah, Andrew Holschel and David Levy went hard. Too bad I can barely hear it because the audio mixing is terrible. I almost want to say DLC 1 was harder, actually. Like, because there was so much spirit spam in DLC 1 and like the fog arenas and yeah, I almost want to say DLC 1 might have been harder. Yeah, duh. Like, that boss was probably the best boss in the game, I feel like. But even, like, still... I don't know. Definitely wasn't the hardest thing. 
Yeah, the, all the spirit barons, exactly. What's up, boys? Yeah. Yeah, no, there was just so many more spirits in DLC 1. Our Ollie. Chuggernaut. Yeah, I'd say in terms of, of difficulty, I, yeah. Thinking on it, DLC 1. And I feel like they kind of underused some of the enemies, the new enemies. I mean, I, like, I'm kind of happy at least the cursed prowlers were only used a few times. But I'm surprised they were used so few times. Story prediction? I think just like they put the Doom Slayer to rest, they're going to put Doom to rest. They're probably going to give it a few years. I don't think we'll see a new Doom for at least four, three to four years from now. Like, I think they're going to take a break for a bit. Obviously, we're still going to get new content, new battle mode content, new master levels. But <laughs> senior human resources manager, Jessica Harris, Jessica in HR. It's not the end of the it's not the end of Doom. Like, <laughs> They're not ending Doom. The Doom Slayer will be back and he will be killing more demons, but they're gonna need to find out how they're gonna write that into the story. They have to figure out a way to bring him back. And they will, they will. We'll see him, we'll see Doom again. Yeah, you end in a, in a second. I'm going to just wait. I have a feeling there might be something a little special at the end of the credits. If anything, maybe like a funny image at the very end or, or something. That new battle mode content. It's already been confirmed. Like the new battle mode demon is back on the board. And yeah, invasion. There will be invasion. Someday. Eventually. Imagine invasion in the DLC. I've never actually thought of that until right now. That needs to happen. There better be invasion in the DLC. Imagine the Dark Lord boss fight, but the fucking the summons, like those, like the the things he summons in, like the the phantoms. What if they're just d demon players? <laughs> that would be so fucking busted. Oh my god, nah, that would not work. That would not work. It would be kind of cool though. Not gonna lie, I'm a little disappointed that we didn't get to fight him like out of the suit. Like, we only fought him in the mech suit. That's it. Like, the whole time you heard me, I was saying, like, all right, come on, get out of the suit. Let's go. Let's go. Get out the, get out of the suit. Get out of the mech. But I guess that just doesn't happen. And Hello? that's probably the hardest part. Are you still here? Great. I have a message for you from Marty, Hugo, and all the hardworking devs at id Software. Thanks for playing. Hell wouldn't be the same without you. Hell yeah, dude. That's what's up. Rewards. Nothing. You get nothing. Cool. I'm glad I. I'm glad I did the uh, the credits. Cause I got to hear the intern say some uh, cute shit to me. Wow. Look at all the shit. Give it. Give it all. Give it to me. Give it to me. Boom. Ancient Gods. Part two. Finished. With only a single death. Literally a single death. <laughs> nice. 